October is Depression and Mental Health Awareness Month, and experts at the American Psychological Association say while communicating with friends on social media can be helpful for child development, when used in the wrong context, it can be harmful for developing brains. ABC's Rena Roy has tips on how to keep teens safe on social media. Keeping an eye on social media activity can be a difficult task for parents, and many are unsure of how to protect their kids' mental health. The American Psychological Association released a first-of-its-kind health advisory earlier this year on how to keep teens safe on social media. There are a lot of people talking about the role of social media on mental health, but not all the conversations are reflecting what we know from the science. APA Chief Science Officer Dr. Mitch Prinstein says the main takeaway from the study, social media literacy is key. Adults as well as kids are likely to fall for mis and disinformation that's out there, might believe in someone's profile as being real when it's really just a bot. Although Dr. Prinstein would like to see changes at the policy level and from tech companies, he says there are steps parents can take right now to help protect their teens on social media. The APA recommends parents limit social media use by adjusting screen time settings on devices or platforms, protect their sleep by shutting down devices at a certain time each night, and have weekly discussions with kids on their social media use. What is it like? What are you looking for on there? What do you find and how do you make meaning of it? Because when kids have questions about their tech experiences, we want them to feel comfortable going to parents to ask for advice and input. Parents should also check if their kids are developing social media dependence. Probably a good idea to ask your kids every once in a while if they've ever felt that they can't get off social media even when they want to, or if using it or trying to keep using it is interfering with their daily routines and responsibilities. And when it comes to talking to your teen about social media, it's probably a good idea to approach kids as the experts they are in this area and to recognize they care so deeply about their social relationships, as they should at this point in their life. Rena Roy, ABC News, New York.